trying to make it window mode. Hold up. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, my fucking God. There we go. Can I just get, like, a... Uh... Can I, can I get borderless full screen? Maybe with borderless gaming. Oh, it's running. Zoo? Hell yeah. It is pretty fucking loud, yeah. What am I looking at? I don't even know. Intro allowed, yeah? This is way too dang, dude. Palette customization. Display extra math? The fuck does that mean? <laughs> Next color palette? Oh, you can change it. Ugh. Green? Oh, green is kind of cool. I kind of like green, to be honest. And we can always change it, you know? Standard? What is standard? This kind of hurts my eyes. What about this? This is kind of horrorish. Yeah, let's go for that one. Oh, God. <laughs> Ooh, spooky. I didn't lower the volume. It should be fine now. Chad, I can't decide. This is like Flux. Is Loki like the Pokemon soundtrack that made people commit suicide? Ooh. Oh yeah, I remember that. Uh, fuck yeah, let's just choose one. The normal one? This hurts my eyes though. I kind of want, like this. The Abyssal, let's go with the Abyssal, new story. Fuck this virus game, dude. Jesus Christ. Freaks me out. Yo, I need to somehow make it full screen window. God oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> this shit freaks me out, dude. The game hasn't even started. This game has already made me walk head my pass and throw up all over my screen. The horror <laughs> is amazing. True. True. We might be good now, though. This might be fine. Yo! I think. Check full screen border modes A and B. Yo! Whoa! What the fuck? 
Oh, okay, we got it. This is fine. This is fine. Oh, what? Cool. We're good, we're good. News story. Alright, here we go. Would you like to customize your next playthrough's look? There are many color palettes on display to choose from. That's what I did. Wait, two bit? One bit? Fuck, I kinda want... I kinda wanna go back and uh... Increase the volume. I'm not sure I can do that in game though. What the fuck is going on? If that's your first time playing World of Horror, it's recommended that you start with a spine chilling story of school scissors option. Okay. Yo! Spine chilling story of school scissors. A tiny section of a standard playthrough showcasing one of the available mysteries. Okay, sure. Huh? I'll play normal. I don't know what this game is. City of Shokaba, Japan. Something strange is happening in our town. Robed figures can be seen gathering in the woods at night. People are going missing. Disgusting creatures are terrorizing the seaside. What the fuck? Okay. What? Oh, hello. The rapid techno technological progress of the modern era brings comfort. But also new unknown threats. Yo! Old gods, malicious eldritch beings who ruled the earth aeons ago, are awakening as reality starts to crumble. Armed with clues, spells, and your dwindling sanity, you'll investigate mysteries across city and in realms beyond. Is, is it really still too loud? I know BS looks fine. Oh well, whatever, I'll lower it a bit more. Oh, well, Senpai Moisturizer. Thanks for the sub, man. I welcome you. Thank you. Uh, an old train slows down and stops at its last station. The end of the world is at hand and you finally arrived in a doomed town. Alright, alright. Okay, I'm this little boy right here, I guess. This is so weird. The story so far. Welcome to World of Horror. Important messages will appear here. Okay. Is that spells? What the fuck? Items? Start this. Alright, cool, cool, cool. This is way too low, I think. I want it like this, and then I'm gonna lower it for you guys. I don't know if that's good. You have to tell me. Uh, alright, cool. Sure. The story so far? I'm stuck. <laughs> You've been following the weird cult for weeks now. Um, barely surviving the encounter with a skin hag at the nursery. It's a race against time and you can't rest until our town is safe. I still have no idea what this game is, by the way. Combat tutorial. On. Start the mis mystery. This game is way too dank. Another boy from your school has disappeared. Rumor has it a terrible woman has returned from the grave. A woman with the widest smile. And the sharpest scissor. Investigate this mystery, sure. Your missing friend has left you a notebook. If the rumors are true, to stop the tall woman with scissors, you'll need to perform a ritual to force her material form to appear in our dimension. Okay. Accomplish this requires first a drawing of an eldritch sigil and the light lighting of a holy candle. Sorry, right, you can hope your friend has left then. Somewhere around school. Alright, dude. Explore school then. What the fuck? 
As you enter the school gym, you notice a strange black doll propped up against the wall. Oh, needs anatomy class perk? Well, I'm com I'll come closer. Against your better judgment, you approach the doll. What you see makes you gasp in horror. Oh wait, this is drawn in paint? Really? The doll isn't a doll. Your sudden movement causes tiny black spiders to flee, revealing a white half-eaten corpse. Minus two reason. Okay, I'll resolve this event. You feel like something horrible is happening within the school. You must hurry and find those items. Holy candles and blessed chalk, huh? Okay. Check out school lockers. What the fuck? I don't know what is happening, Chad. I'm exploring the school. <gasps> oh, what? Oh, I thought that would remove this. Uh, uh. Ouch. I think. Oh. A wooden bat. Yoink it. Inside a locker, you find a baseball bat. Feeling you might need it later, you decide to pick it up. Okay, I got a wooden bat. Nice. Cool, dude. Yes. You need a tiny key, okay. All right, I got, I got, I got a bat. I don't know how to equip it, but I have a bat. Oh, okay. Equip. Aha, uh -huh. there we go. Explore school again. This is one of the most weird games I've ever played. Oh, you find an old trophy case set in a seemingly abandoned corridor. Everything inside is covered in a thick layer of dust. One metal seems particularly valuable. Break that shit. You break the glass window, cutting yourself a little bit in the process. What? Just use the wooden bat for it. Metal isn't made of gold, but you'll be able to sell it easily. Plus one funds, minus one stamina. Okay, cool. Great. You find an additional page from your friend's diary. It seems that the blessed chalk was left in the pool. Oh, the pool? I'm peeking outside. Uh, to open the door, click on the handle and drag the mouse. Oh, what the fuck? Come on, guys. You shouldn't risk that again. Okay. I'll, uh... I'll, uh... We need to go to the pool. Black Belt Chef, thanks for the 27 months. And Heartblood, thank you for the 3 bucks. Echo, thanks for the 4 months. Dogger, thanks for the 3. And Failskill, thanks for 17. Do you enter the damp smelling sport ring? Alright. There's a backpack drifting on a swimming board in the middle of the pool. Could it be what you're looking for? Enter the water! A bloated figure emerges from the murky water, blocking her only way out of the pool. Way too dang. During each turn, you'll build a sequence of attacks and moves from the action ring. <laughs> B. This is the action ring? Oh, this is the action ring? Once you fill the last sequence bar, press the launch sequence button to finish your turn. What the fuck? <laughs> this is insane! Okay, uh... Kick. Attack without a weapon. But I have a weapon. Please, Viking. Okay, I'll just put the fist. Kick, kick, kick. And when I've kicked enough, uh, once you fill the sequence bar, press the launch sequence button. All right. All right. All right. Uh, 
Uh, what time we discovered new combat moves available through the action filter? But at first you need a weapon. Find and choose an action called look for an imp improvised weapon. But I don't need it. I have a wooden fucking bat. <laughs> What's this? Prepare your attack. Oh, next attack is guaranteed to hit. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Attack with your weapon. Strong attack. I'll do strong attack, dude. Fuck you! Now what? Clear? Oh, well. First, you need a weapon. Find and choose an action called look for an improvised weapon look for an improvised weapon okay i did it launch sequence Yo. <laughs> what the fuck i feel like a five head when i'm playing this like i'm some kind of hacker man a new item has appeared in the upper right corner that's your inventory. Well, there's nothing there. There's nothing behind my cam. Click it and find the equip highlighter button. Okay. Uh, click it. Well, I would if there was a thing there. <laughs> A branch? Oh, here. Alright. I did it. Okay, I, I'm starting to see how this works. I got it. I understand. I got this shit, dude. Launch sequence, baby. Zoo, zoo. I killed him! I did not kill him. Where is his health? Here? You bash bloated teacher minus four health. You missed the attack. And he hits me. Okay. Okay, dude. Cool. Well, I'm gonna kill you now, alright? You know what? No, let's do this. Boom, boom, boom. Can't I do it three times? Yeah, there we go. Alright, here it comes. Launch sequence, baby. Dead, dead, dead. You- I missed one attack. That's why. Yikes. Alright, I kill him now. You defeated Bloated Teacher. Fucking easy. Okay, I get it. <clears throat> oh, you get XP too. Where's the level up? It says Doom here. What does that mean? 3%? You found Blessed Chalk, which can be used to draw the sigil in your ritual. Copy the sigil as best as you can on the blackboard. Hopefully it will be enough. What's up, Pixel? Yeah, yeah, Whiskers, I should do that. My face is in cuts. Ah, he was born like that or something. Oh, wait, draw sigil. Uh. Wait, should be correct now? When? I'm just gonna click until it. There. This is correct? Alright, cool. What is number one? Oh, okay. Whoopsie. What was the design? Papi, I should be correct now. Okay. Sure, let's just leave it like that. Now what? I need to find the holy candle. Explore school. You carefully enter the biology classroom. The room seemed empty at first until you switched the lights on. You gasp in horror. <gasps> Lying in a pool of blood is one of you the teachers with a fruit knife in her hand. Their hand, I mean. There's a jar of formaldehyde on the nearest table. Mesmerized by the spiral pattern on sea creature's skin, you step over the dead body and come closer. And then the voice says, Star, dude. It's a forgotten specimen. Specimen?
Pez, thanks for the one year. Pop Spaghetti, thanks for the five. She. Thank you. Okay, let's see additional support actions. Defensive spiritual actions. Cool. Uh, th that's good. Prepare your attack. Yeah, I want to use the bat, but the bat's fucking dead. Like, the bat's gone. Anyways, uh, what's this? Attack boost. Fill the comma sequence white bar. Oh no, never mind. Uh, attack with your weapon. Let's see what this was then. Support actions. Improvised weapon. One time use only. Need stamina or reason to be lower than three. Damn, son. You don't have time to change the equipment? Ah, oh, fuck off. Defensive actions, what's this? Run away, ah. Oh. oh, you get a doom penalty though, whatever that is. Meditate. Brace for impact. Oh, okay, cool. Okay, need dodge. Nice, all right, cool. Spiritual actions, clap. Part of a ritual, five bows and claps. Even if you don't get it right, you'll be provided with a hint. Uh, bow. Part of ritual. Pray. Okay, cool. Yeah. Okay, I'll just use my fucking branch again. Here we go. Oh, it's 107, and this needs 69. Okay. Okay, I see it. This is the meter. All right, cool. This is cool. Fuck it. Launch sequence. Zoo. You're forced to attack yourself? Where's my health? I don't know. Six? You think this? Stamina? Yeah, it, it is a heart, I guess. Fuck, dude. I died. Whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Um... can't do that, but I can do this though. That is six plus two, that's eight. If I if I hit all of this, he dies. Yes, yes, easy. What? You're forced to attack your fuck off. Kick his ass. That's right. Wait, what's that? Pick it up. A lump of flesh. Cool. Yeah, it says Rhea here. I don't know if the screen is cut off. I don't think it is, but it's really hard to see. It says Re. Re. Anyways, it's all combat. I fucking won. There's nothing about my well, there is something about my webcam, but Um that seems a bit scuffed. That scene's scuffed. All the scenes are scuffed. <laughs> Whatever. Um oh, Re is on. yeah. You found scissors. Wait, the sound of scissors is getting louder. You must hurry. What the fuck? I I I I want to switch. I want to I want to I want to use a wooden bat. Here. Equip. Thank you. All right, this game's kind of sick actually. Uh, I could go bottom left for camera, but I need to fix the scene. <laughs> Hold up. You must hurry. Okay, sure. I have, um... I have wooden bat equipped now. Cool. Explore school. I'm still looking for the holy candles, right? I'm only covering the text, uh, the time of when it happened. Which is literally time, real lifetime, 2045. What the fuck is this? Impossible angles and seemingly moving lines make your head spin. Needs Ukami ally? Okay. Stare in disbelief. Charisma check success. How is this possible? Minus one reason. Okay, Eric. Oh, really? Okay. Resolve this event. Oh, there's the candle. 
You found the holy candles in your friend's backpack. You lit them as instructed by the notebook. Everything is ready for the ritual. Oh, perform the ritual. Wait, what's that? Oh, this is the scissor lady. Oh, shit. Oh, she's bonking the thing. Continue. The sigil and holy candles don't seem to have any effect on the horrible monster. Had you drawn it wrong? Really? But it said it was right. Frozen in fear, you watch as the twitching horror gets closer and closer. It raises its enormous scissors and croaks. Ah, oh, my beautiful. Uh, but, but, but it did say it was right, though. Twisting and twitching, the demon woman enters the classroom, cackling menacingly, am I beautiful? What the fuck? She's 26 health? My chance to hit is lowered by 18%? Yikes, dude. Three attack with my baseball bat, baby. Let's go. Launch sequence. Nice. Wait, Papiagia? I am using the fucking attack with your weapon, yeah. What weapon is she de- what 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 damage is she dealing? Try a ritual? Oh yeah, I should try a ritual. Spiritual. Clap. Minus two to all? Oh, it says two all damage here. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. This game is hardcore. Oh, I can regain shit here, though. But that's not worth it, though. Unless I do it... Like, I, I can clear the sequence. I don't even know what this bow even needs. My eyes on the right? Oh my god, they're fucked up. Yeah, yeah I'm reading my hit chance weapon. It's like 60%, I think. Oh, it's 52 on this. Shit. It's 80% with kick. Lump of flesh. Use. Plus 5 stamina. Flip this card. What's my stamina? 4. Use it. Nine. Okay, I used it. I got nine stamina now. Uh, I want to try a prayer shit. I'm going to attack and prayer and see what happens. Here. Part of a ritual. Most common rituals are a combination of five bows and claps. Five? That's five claps right there. And then I need five bows. Wait, even if you don't get it right, you'll be provided with the him. Oh, I've gained a new status. Holes? Oh, wait. You place a lump of flesh on your wound and it connects with your body. It wasn't a good idea. You've gained a new status. Holes. Oh, it's five in total. Clap bow, clap bow, clap. Like this? I, I can try it and see what happens. I'm probably gonna fucking die here. Holes. Ew! Each day more holes appear? It's a mutation curse. Ugh, my skin's crawling from that. Okay, let's launch sequence and see what happens. Nothing happens. You think you got one ritual move, right? Oh, fucking great. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking die. She does minus two to all. How am I gonna kill her? Let's check defensive actions. Meditate. Oh, one reason, one stamina. While spiritual actions... One stamina, two reason. Oh. Run? No... Oh, dude, maybe I have to, yeah. Fuck, maybe I should try to run. You can't run from this encounter. Fuck's sake. Alright. 
time needed 110. Fuck it, I'm doing it. And then I'm just gonna... I kick. Kick! You punched scissor. Oh, I dodged her! Woo! Game plans. Only 20 more health, dude. Only 20 more health. Uh, <laughs> I still don't. The thing is, there's no point in praying. I think I should just keep dodge using one dodge. It drastically lowers hit chance, so <laughs> just keep fucking kicking and dodging until I win, dude. You missed the attack. And she stabs me! It's over, dude. Fuck, man. You can complete the ritual? How? Spells? Oh, counterize. What the fuck? Plus two support. Forget this spell. Yeah, I think we're fucked here. I think you really have to nail the ritual. I think we're fucking dead. I'm just gonna kick her ass. And she stabs me, and I'm gonna fucking die now. Use it. Okay, fine. It does give me plus two spam, stem, spam, stamina. Alright, I mean, sure. Also, pull Gesh. She raises her scissors. Okay, I think... Wait, she raises her scissors. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of fucked here. I think she's preparing for a really strong attack. You can use that thing you can only use below three stamina ring. What thing was that then? <laughs> yeah, I gotta try dodging and pray, pretty much. That's what I have to do. I have no other choice. Can I do some- wait! Wait, dodge kick. There's still 35. I could, um, spiritual maybe. 35, clap. One stamina, two reason. Yes, yes, yes. Let's do this. Frozen in fear, you watch as she gets closer. Her sharp scissors are slowly cutting through your cheeks as she asks you. Am I beautiful? You've perished. Okay, I know this game now. Yo, this game's kind of sick, actually. Oh, it actually says, you didn't complete any mystery. You saw four new events. You encountered three new enemies. You unlocked one new achievement. Cause of death. Killed by scissor woman. She, she, she chopped my uh, cheeks. Okay, I died in the tutorial. That's fine. This is okay. Oh, that's a new background. Way too dank. New story. I want to try it again. Two bit. Uh, randomize, I guess. I don't know. Oh, no. Oh, God, stop. Yo! Fuck. Oh, cool. Yeah, I want to do this one again. I got this shit now. I know what to do. Yeah, it's two colors now, dude. Uh, we know this already. We heard it. Here I am. All the art was made in paint. That is insane. Start the mystery. Investigate. Alright. Hmm. <clears throat> Let's go, dude. I'm gonna explore the lockers first, so I know there's a bat in here. We found a new item, wooden bat. Let's go, dude. Equip that bad boy. All right, cool. All right, thank you, Hilda. Thank you. Uh, Emilia, third, three year anniversary. I hope you're well. 
Thank you so much. That's awesome. That's awesome. Giant robots, thanks for 19 months. SkyDT, thanks for SkyDC, thanks for 22. Thank you. Um, check storage for notebook. Oh, maybe I should have done this before. You retreat an item from storage. Friend's diary. Inspect. Okay. Yeah, I know. I guess I know we went through it. Uh, this sigil can weaken the demon for a while. Oh, this is what it looks like. It shows right here. Careful with the lines. Okay. Yeah. Wait, I've hidden the candles in one of the classrooms. Tomorrow up from the ritual. Maru's acting strange. I need to talk with her after class. All right, cool, cool, cool. Let's go, let's go. Back. Explore school. Um, yeah, I don't have this, so stare in disbelief. Can't do much. You must hurry and find those items. Yeah, working on it, dude. Working on it. Explore school. You find an old trophy set. I still want to grab it so I can sell. I do lose one stamina, but it's worth it, dude. You found an additional page from your friend's diary. The blessed shark is left on the roof. Sure. On the roof, you find the girl your friend was talking about. Oh, this is a new event. In one hand, she holds a bag. In the other, a pair of bloody scissors. This is Maru? Minus one to all, 15 power. Yo, I'll fuck you up with my baseball bat, bitch. Wooden bat, baby. Actually, let's clear sequence. Actually, if all of these hit, I win. And it's a 65% chance, here we go. Yes? Ooh! Easy peasy, baby. You defeated Maru. You found the blessed chalk, which can use to draw the sigil. Yes, we can draw the sigil now. Um, you copy this as best as you can on the blackboard. Hopefully it'll be enough. No, it's not. We have to check uh, friend's diary. It looks like this. I can't cheat. I can't do screenshot. Okay, it's like a weird sailor thing egg. I have no idea. Oh, this one needs to be upside down. Kind. This is so... Okay, I think this is right, isn't it? No, wait. No, no, no. That's right. That's correct. That's correct. That has to be right, right? I don't think I can change this triangle and, like, to change it anymore. This is correct. That is correct. This has to be correct, chat. Of course it is. You see this? It's the upside down triangle. We got the line. We got this. This has to be it. What else could it be? It's the only triangle you have here. It should be correct now, it even says. It's not going to be an exact match, chat. Because this is scuffed in a notebook. While this is, um... This is correct. I believe this is correct. There is no other triangle I can change. And then you can only change this. This is correct. I. This is definitely correct. Continuing. Uh, explore school. So I have the blessed shark. I still need the holy candles. You hear a faint sound while walking outside the biology classroom. Inside is an old anatomy model. It's heart beating. The sight almost makes you sick. Minus one stamina? What? The sound of scissors getting louder. You must hurry. I'm working on it. I'm working on it.
Hearing footsteps around you realize you're not the only student here. A girl wearing a demon's mask starts giggling as she's getting closer. Ten health, it's a young witch. Oh, I'll fuck you up. Shit, that doesn't work. Just a casual young witch, witch in the school, dude. I mean, I could do this, but I just hope everything hits. It's 60%. Fuck it, yeah, let's go. Fuck, I missed one. It's over. Young witch giggles? It stabs you with me with a box cutter? With a snicker, young witch stabs you with a boss box cutter. Well, fuck you then. Now I'm gonna punch your ass. What's that? Pick it up. Oh, it's a knife. Cool. How good is it? Oh, I got the- everything is ready for the ritual. Nice. Damage 3, speed 60. Chance to hit 70. Damage 4, speed 80. Chance to hit 70. I mean, I'd rather use the fucking... Bat, yo. I don't know if you can do slot B. Alright, perform the ritual. Let's go. What's that? You take a step back um, as a breathing enorm amorphous mass slowly takes shape. Soon it becomes a tall woman like creature with three faces, all connected by a wide smile. Now it's your chance to fight and defeat this horror. It's also your only chance. Prepare for combat. The demon woman enters the classroom crackling. Am I beautiful? I mean, she's still the fucking same. <laughs> uh, well, she looks different, though. She looks different. Oh, additional 10% chance to hit. And it stacks. Yo, that's sick though. Why haven't I been using that? Dude. Let's go. I'm launching. Oos. Oos. That's right. Oh, I, I missed once. Oh, fuck me. Do you have to do... Oh, I think you have to do that. Your next attack is guaranteed to hit. Oh, yeah, your next attack it is. Fuck me. Uh, yeah, you have to do this first and then do this. Ass... But I think I'll just do the guaranteed attack instead. Fuck this. Fuck. Uh, let's just do this. Fuck, it's not enough. Shit, 59. Alright, let's just kick her ass. She has 8 health. I'll, I'll fuck. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win. There's one off lethal, yes. I'm gonna win now, though. Guaranteed attack on this. Six damage. And then I will kick her. Which is 80% chance, which should be the last two health. Yes. Alright. Resolve combat. Ancient horror lies dead on the classroom floor, slowly dissolving into nothingness. But you uh, you find your friend, gravely wounded but alive. You help him and you limp away from the school as the police sirens get louder. I got ending A! It's a bunch of different endings, apparently. Cool. Continue. The horror is over for now. That was literally the tutorial, by the way. Pretty cool. Continue there.
Yeah, yeah, I know that. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, this is kind of cool. Let's try one more. But... Oh, God. Less than five hour first level getting better at games. Can I just get like one good randomization, please? One that doesn't kill me? Oh my fucking god. Ugh. I like this one. It's kind of easy on the eyes, you know? Extracurricular activity. Sure. We know this already. It's the same. Same old, same old. Media reports of various people um, with seemingly supernatural skills. Could it have any connection with the news about stars disappearing from the night sky? Really? Holy fuck. Old gods rule. Casting spells raise doom instead of its normal costs. Okay. Nice. Okay, so I'm a, I'm a girl now. Welcome and thank you for trying World of Horror. Inspired by adventure games from the 80s, the visual overload may be a little bit disorienting in the beginning. In this short tutorial, I'll do my best to explain various elements and prepare you to fight the horrible old gods. Wait, one guy made this game in paint. That's the main game screen here. You'll interact with your surroundings, solve mysteries, and fight enemies. All right. That's you, World of Horus RPG. There it is. That's perception. That's fun. That's charisma. And this is knowledge. Yes, of course. Uh, that's your inventory. You can keep up to four items. Click here to inspect. Use or equip anything you pick up. Yo, Patrick 26 man. Thank you. There are three equipment slots. Equipped items do not count towards the four items limit. Okay, cool. Trinkets and armor, that is. All right, nice. As you progress with your playthrough, more helpful tips will appear. Would you like to turn a combat tutorial on? No, I don't need it anymore. I'm good. I'm fucking pro now. My home. It's empty. No mail today. Back in your home, you think of your next move. You're not currently investigating any weird mystery. Recent newspaper clippings and notes collected in the next room should point you in the right direction. Take a peek through people. Whoa, weird. I learned a new spell, Absorb. Watch TV. We're shocked after what you did. Her voice is always so calm. Alright. Take a bath? Oh my. Warm water, small XP boost. Cold water, extra reason gained. Yeah, yeah, the first mission was just tutorial. This is like the real game. Hot water, extra stamina regained. I'll take that. I already had 17. <laughs> Change clothes? Oh no, I tabbed out. Fuck. I didn't mean to tab out. Elgato, come back. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Spire. I know what GeoGuessr is. I know. I would suck at it, though. 
It's a nice movie poster. How do I change clothes? Oh, here. Oh, you have no sound anymore? What? Come back. Come back. What happened? What the fuck happened? Come back. We good? I like this one. Let's go with this one, dude. For some reason, my mouse got all fucking heavy when I tapped out. It's like heavier to move it. Um... Inexplicable and morbid events are plaguing your town for some time now. You've marked down five of them, hoping that there is something connecting them. You can tackle these five mysteries in any order you want. Beware, your decisions will haunt you in and influence yet unsolved mysteries. Oh shit, alright. Curious case of contagious coma. Rotten report of rancid ramen. Fine chilling story of school scissor. Oh, we've done that one already, tutorial. Horrible history of household hell. Vicious verses of a violent vigil. Uh, rancid ramen. Out of thin air, a brand new ramen restaurant opens in town, adored by everyone. Once people take a bite, they can't stop. Day and night, the queues stretch out the door. The shambling customers stuffing themselves dish after dish, while the blind owner sits silently behind the counter, grinning and polishing his gleaming knives. Once people take a bite, they can't stop. Day and night, the queues stretch out the door. The shambling customers stuffing themselves dish after dish. There's 12 random mysteries right now. He plans to get up to 20. Wow. The blind owner sits silently- oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, investigate the mystery. To advance this mystery, investigate the circuit location. As we progress, the location and the rules may change. Apartments, alright? The newest ramen shop. Yes, yes, yes. Let's go. Investigate apartments. Mr. Triple O, your neighbor is a horror manga artist. He's struggling to come up with a satisfying ending for his newest story. Oh, I can share my experience here. If I've if I have done some uh, cases before, wait, Junji Ito, is that him? <laughs> I don't know what he looks like. I just know Chad has told me about him. <laughs> That's kind of fun. But yeah, I can share experiences here, but I guess I don't have any because I haven't done any cases, so... What's that picture? Oh. You catch a glimpse of the painted thing. Suddenly you feel very weak and excuse yourself to leave. Something tru truly evil has you in its grasp? Weird. I mean, I still have to investigate apartments, though. Discard two item cards to can Dumpster dive? Weird. Who this be? It's boosted today. Let's hang out some other time, okay? Okay. Feels ignored, man. Well, let's go here again. Is this the same thing? Oh, no. As you prepare a bath, you think about all the possible leads so far. You're very tight, so maybe ice cold water is a good idea. Oh, she's smoking in the bath, dude. S 
strength check failure. Your body clearly wasn't prepared for a cold bath and you can feel the cold coming. Oh, come on. Minus two stamina. Not cool, dude. I'm still going to investigate this. Our master is a coming and with all we all can bask in its glory. Uh, it's a magician glitched minus two doom damage. I have no weapon. I have nothing. Bemind rambling. Learn a new spell or gain experience. It costs one doom. I have three doom. Yeah, I can search for weapon. This is true. Uh, support actions here. Look for an improvised weapon. And then I'm just gonna try to dodge, I think. Dodge. Perfect. I found a branch. He sends me flying? Okay. Well, we got a branch, though. How did I equip this? Oh, there. Throw an enemy. Huh. Equip. Now we got a branch. Now we can do some more shit. 65% uh, chance to hit. Fuck me. I'm going to die here. How much is this? 93. 36. Fuck, man. 75, 85. Does this... Yeah, it does stack, it says, so... Shit me. How did that miss? I missed one. Yeah, exactly. He does minus two doom damage. So I was also wondering, is that good? Because I could do a spell somewhere, whatever that was. Oh, it adds. I thought it said minus. Oh, I get it. Okay, okay, I get it. Well, that's not good, though. Doom is not good. I think it's probably insta-kill 100%. I'm gonna keep doing this. Oops. Why is my last attack? It keeps missing. I probably can run. I don't know. Spells. I can't even check spells. Oh, absorb. Uh, never mind. Deals two damage, gain two stamina. It costs four reason. Oh, really? After your last gaze, casting this doesn't cost reason. Okay. What's the downside? Guessing it costs doom, yeah. I don't want more doom, fuck that. I fuck him up. You suck the life force out of your enemy. Thank you. Now I'm just gonna keep doing this. Hit you with my fucking branch, alright? The last branch attack never hits. I'm not sure why. But my doom just keeps going up, though. Fuck, it's too much. No. Pessimistic, thanks for the two months, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I am doomed. 
pretty much. I don't get why this keeps missing. Or why it doesn't work. It should deal 3 damage, but... Look at his health bar now. 4? Nothing. Every time this happens. But yeah, now it's over though. That should be a 105% chance to hit him, so boom. Okay. You stand in line for hours, your questions fall on deaf ears, and you're shunned. Discard two items. Okay. Sure. Travel to hospital, travel to forest. Village, mansion, seaside, school. I'm supposed to go downtown. Fuck yeah, let's go. Walking through the park, you find the little girl crying alone in the playground. When you ask what's wrong, she says that she can't find her mommy. Luckily, you spot the girl's address on a backpack lying nearby. I'll take her home, dude. Little girl comes and tells you that she can- Oh wait, you offer to take her home. When you get there, the terrified mother slams the door in your face. From behind the door, she starts screaming to get the girl away. Oh. The little girl comes and tells you that she can take it from here. What the fuck? I got XP though? No idea how much I need to level up. That was weird. It was a demon, I guess. You're pleasantly surprised to meet your old friend while waiting for a train. She's undoubtedly changed a lot since you've last seen her. Uh... These days, she's moderating a web forum dedicated to the paranormal. Maybe she knows something useful. Invite for a coffee. In between conspiracy theories and Bigfoot sightings, you hear a worrying rumor about an old god slowly awakening to rule the earth once again. Could this be the reason for recent horrific events? Cool. Oh yeah, I should try to get good to shop, yeah. Through the dirty restaurant window you notice a shady looking man wearing a jacket covered in strange symbols. He stops in front of a house, visibly nervous, before he enters the house. He turns around as if he's checking for any unwanted followers. I'm gonna follow him. <gasps> I got success though, perception. Oh, it's mine! I lost Doom! Yeah, I had 20. The door is locked, but you repeat the knocking pattern the suspicious man used. A moment later, the door opens and a surprised teen with greasy hair asks who the hell you are. Mistaking these nerds for coldfish sure is embarrassing, but deep inside you're relieved. Alright. Oh yeah, uh, I wanted to go, uh... You're already there? Oh. Uh, there's no shop here. I guess it still is in downtown? Let's see. A sudden growl coming from behind a corner makes you stop. There, ah, uh, blind? Fuck me. It's a ghoul. Two stamina damage. Uh, you run into an old friend. Oh, into old friend. I really wish I had other weapons and shit, you know? I ain't got nothing. I can absorb, though. Which I will do. It costs reason, but I'll do this. Oh, Doom is 23 now! Fuck me! So much Doom. Eighty percent. Oh wait, attack boost. Oh, never mind. Eighty percent. Three damage. Four damage. Now we dealt damage. Nice. Ghoul bites you. Well, I bashed him. Seven health. Nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. All spells cost doom. Yeah. Shit. Whatever. I can fuck this one up now. 
Oh yeah, you used Doom instead of Reason. It said that. Yeah, I remember now. Fuck me. I missed? At 80%? When is ding? Oh, investigate lab. With a slick hand, you fill a vial with a soup and walk out without tasting the weird dish. I don't want to investigate it now, though. I would love to go to, uh... What are all these weird things out there? Well, investigate lab, I guess. With the pulling of some delicate strings, you get the ramen into a lab. While handing over the gathered material, you hesitate. What should you send to the laboratory? Uh, can I ditch? Cigarettes and bullets? Town status, you. Oh, I need a hundred XP. Okay. Old God. Uth Yolust's Towering Eye. Casting spells races doom percent. Yeah, okay. Alright. Um, a mere day later, your friend rings your door. Her face is pale and in a shaky hand. She holds an analysis sheet. You usher her in and bolt the door. You feel ill looking at the charts. While they couldn't identify some of the particles, they did discover a highly addictive drug in the broth. The ramen restaurant must be closed immediately. A week later, police and an official stand where the ramen restaurant used to be. Nothing remains but a gap in the street and aimless confused customers. You'd like to believe that was the end of it, but snippets and newspapers from other cities unsettle you. Brief articles about an exciting new ramen restaurant opening and its mysterious owner keep showing up. You can no longer eat noodles without feeling ill. Okay. It's not over though. The old god stirs, click here to reveal its effects. Dangerous bands of rioters are gathering around downtown area. The police is hopeless. Inside your mailbox, find a small key. Wait, that could that be for the school? Scissor lady? Take the key. I feel like I should do the school and try to open that now. Maybe I'll get something sweet. Oh yeah, this is a tiny key, I guess, yeah. Says lighthouse key? Oh shit, yeah. Let's go to the lighthouse then, fuck it. The ominous lighthouse has been closed down for longer than you can remember. Enter it. Oh, multiple padlocks prevent you from entering the building. You need five keys. Huh. Bang. Yeah, I'm gonna take a bath, I will. What the fuck? Thank you. I don't think this takes up a slot. Or maybe it does? I don't know. Open drawer. Okay. Um, let's try one more. Well, I can't choose this one now, though it's not solved, however. 
my doom went down a little bit. I am liking the game, yeah. It is actually really good. Oh, it says endings discovered here. One out of two. There's another ending for the school. Three endings. More and more people fall unconscious and cannot be awakened. People trying to wake up, pay, wake the patients up, result with them falling into coma themselves. A whole wing of the town's hospital has been dedicated for the comatose. Is there anything connecting these people and how did this strange illness start? Investigate the circle location. Yeah. I wanted to go to the shop for items here. Okay. A flashlight. Perception. Plus one reason adds a new status. Click on the dogo. I can't. Salt. Oh, deals four damage to uh, food type enemy. Ghost type enemies, I mean. Random discount item. What the fuck? Oh, Chronicon. Thanks for the 47 months. Thank you. But yeah, we can check out this chapter. And then I, I want to check out the uh, Curse of Annabelle or whatever the fuck it was. Let's go to the police station. Uh, you're stopped by a police woman. How can we help you? Share some information. 30 XP, 1 FND. Wait! Shopping for item takes precious time. Plus 4 doom? Oh, fuck off. I'm going where we need to. Investigate the village location twice to complete this quest. Sure. Feeling hungry, you've entered a small local restaurant and ordered the daily special made with today's catch. Just where the hell did those fishermen go? A one by one hurt, I'll eat it. It looks... Interesting. 100 XP for level up. Feeling the eyes of the restaurant's guest on your back, you take a small bite of the smelly seafood. It's surprisingly good, but you kindly you kindly refuse another serving. Cool. Um, I have one out of two. I want to investigate again, though. The trail to an abandoned Shinto shrine is overgrown and steep. It could be an important place to investigate. Take the safe- I'm gonna take the quick route, of course I am. Because you're in a hurry, you hike to the hilltop. Burnt out candle wax and dried blood around the shrine mean a new sinister cult has claimed this location. Sup, crate. Resolve. An old man from the village hands you a package. This should help you understand the illness. Oh, I got dust of seeing. What the fuck? Momentarily renders invisible creatures partially visible. Sets enemy power to zero? Oh, that means I can hit them 100%, I think. The more power they have, the less chance I have of hitting them, so... That's good. It has no smell. Alright, cool. I'm not gonna use it. Of course. That'd be weird. Alright, let's go, go, go. School, school, school. The corridor is flooded by a black sludge that's slowly oozing from under the door to to the chemistry classrooms. A damp, moldy stench grows as you get closer. How are you gonna get to the other side? Needs empty bottle item. I thought I... Oh yeah, I don't have that. 
I gotta take a detour. I'll take a detour. Better safe than sorry. You take the stairs up to another floor to one sludge. Plus two doom. Okay. That was weird. Dun, dun, dun. The investigation is starting to take a toll on your health. You feel like you're about to fall asleep standing up. How do you address your weakened state? Jog around the block, take a nap, buy a coffee. Needs hot bath skill? I'm gonna take a coffee. The double frappe macchiato is a nice pick-me-up. Nice. Sneak into the hospital to borrow the patient zero's information. You find yourself in an old and used part of the hospital. You take a deep breath. The disgusting smell of thawed remains still lingers in the room. It used to be the hospital's mortuary, where doctors determine the cause of death. Pull the cloth off the dissection table. Search cabinet. Uh, I got a sewing kit. Nice. Something flashed in the corner of a dusty drawer. You reach for your sewing kit. Three stamina minus one charisma. Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. Dun, 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 dun. Part of therapy, some patients took part in art class. Some of their work fills you with dread. What the fuck? Uh, you're stopped by a masked man wearing a lab coat. He introduces himself as a researcher from Tokyo University, testing a new treatment method that would revolutionize modern medicine. Holding up a pile of documents that tells you he can heal your wounds for free. Oh! Do, will he remove Doom? I can level up? <gasps> I can! You've advanced to the next experience level. Choose one perk and one stat to upgrade. I want strength. I want stamina. Choose it nothing and stamina. Choose it nothing and strength. Oh. Oh. I can re-roll for more doom. So this is random. Plus four stamina is good though. That's like max health, isn't it? Plus four max health, I imagine. There's nothing. Nothing. I could try re-rolling and see what happens, but... Yikes. Oh, these are perks? Oh, I thought this was just some art. What the fuck? Oh my god. Quick thinking. Plus one dexterity. Smaller doom penalty from running from combat. Improved resting at home. I kind of want to reroll again. <laughs> Faster offensive actions. Regain one stamina for all past event skill checks. Oh, really? Discipline. That's pretty good. That just sounds really good. What was this one? Faster attacks. What does that imply? Hard to know what that means, you know? Less point cost, I guess? Yeah. Oh, yeah, because it takes time to... Yeah, it, time is the thing you use for attacking, yeah. Uh, I'm good, dude. Uh, you don't need to heal my ass. You politely decline generous offer and continue on your way. I don't trust that shit. Investigate. Tr -tr -tr 
Despite your best efforts, you feel like the neighborhood is starting to change. Locations threat level increased. Nice. Uh, you found a journal. Oh, really? Hmm, not sure where I can see it, though. Um, describing a certain village and instructions for a summoning ritual. It seems that he tried to contact a being from the dream realms. Oh, car. Sure. Shop. The only metro line in your town connects the university and the science complex. You could take a ride to gain some time, but you've got a feeling something is wrong. Where's the people? I don't want more doom, dude. Wait, I only gained two stamina? No, but I th I think it's max health, right? Like four max health, I think. Fuck, so I wasted it. I should have gotten strength. I thought it would be like... I'm taking a ride. I don't want more doom. Easy. Luck check success. Even though the metro... I should have taken strength on my first level up. Oh, I'm sad now. Even though the metro car is completely empty, you arrive at your station without any problem. Saving valuable time. Easy peasy. The, gar the quarantine wing is guarded closely. You must find a way to sneak through. Alright, let's go. Uh, walking through the crowded space, someone bumps into you and quickly apologizes. Realize what's happening. Perception check failure. Oh, your wallet's missing. She fucking yoink, dude. Resolve this event. Fuck off. Oh, this? I can't click anything on this. There it is. Let's hope you find an answer here. Investigate. Oh. What? Minus one modifier to all skill checks. Oh. Okay. Let's investigate. You managed to sneak through the floor, avoiding the police, and finally reach the quarantine wing, where all the coma patients were brought in. Their pulse is slow slowly weakening and the blood pressure dropping. You must hurry. Oh! Use dust of seeing here. Interesting. I'm gonna do it. Oh. Following the old man's advice, you throw the dust of seeing in the air. It uh, reveals weird elongated monsters hanging from the ceiling. One above every bed. Each creature is connected to a patient with an un undulating tendril. As you try to process everything, one of the disgusting creatures raises its head and looks in your direction. Prepare yourself. Oh god. <laughs> Let's chill a bit. Yeah, can you... There we go. Thirty-seven health, two to all damage. Yikes. I have a fucking branch to kill him with. This is bad. Should branch out on weapons? Yeah. Yes, I should, indeed. 80% chance to hit him there. No clear. Oops. Oh yeah, this shit costs less now. Look at that. This is good shit. Seventy five. Mm. 
No, I pressed the wrong fucking button, and me. He melts my memories? Okay. I'm gonna keep doing this, it's 8 health per turn, so... Oops. I'm fucking killing- I'm killing his ass, dude. He's not gonna be able to beat me. My branch is fucking him up. No, boost the stack, it says on it. I'm fucking winning this easily. Telegraph? Weird. Alright, he's dead though, he's dead. Guaranteed hit. And then, guarantee this. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. <laughs> 20 XP, damn. The creature's severed body falls on the floor and starts melting slowly. The remaining part slithers back into the now closing hole in the ceiling. You've managed to catch a glimpse of the other side. The other side makes you fall on your knees. It wasn't body. You've managed to cut off... It was just a finger? Okay. You've managed to sneak through the floor, avoiding the police, and finally reach the quarantine wing, where all the cool pieces were brought in. The pulse is slowly weakening and the blood pressure dropping. You must hurry. Uh. Oh, roads leading out of town were closed by the police. You'll have to find a new way out. Uh... Okay. Take the key. That's two keys now. I need five, so... Oh yeah, music is glitched. It is. Glitched. Glitched. You seem to get a key for every mystery you do. If I peep through the hole? I am blind. I don't remember how I did that. I don't remember how I peeped through the hole. Wasn't it somewhere here? Oh, move curtain. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, there it was, right. There's someone standing there. Someone is standing in the shadow watching your door. Huh. Interesting. I don't think I can leave, no. Doesn't work. Anyways, uh, let's check out the other one too then. I'll save an exit, good. It's not like you have to do it in one sitting. Weird, nothing happens. You decide to spend some time with your family living in a nearby town and rest. Feeling tainted by the horror you've experienced here, deep inside you know before it's to return one day. This option saves your current progress <laughs> in the game with some restrictions. Currently used equipment will be moved to storage, all spells and will be forgotten, injuries will be healed, and each curse lifted, lowering your max stamina reason by one for each injury. 
And curse her move this way. Okay, sure. Fine. You're taking a break. Kind of cool, though. It's very old school, this game. I'm sure a lot of people are like... Uh, bo uh, what do you say? Boomers? Mods? There's mods here, too. The temporarily turned off and will be coming soon. Oh. Extra. Enemy bestiary. Cool. Ah, it's some cool shit. Wait, what was that? 